Hey, do you want to add some sucker fish to your fish tank? Do you know that sucker fish can add extra benefits to your aquarium? These awesome animals come in many fantastic colors, shapes, and sizes, from the tiny Otisinglus catfish to the common placo, which can reach nearly two feet long. In this video, I'll cover a variety of excellent sucker fish that you can add to your aquarium. So let's dive right into the video. But wait! Before going to our list of best sucker fish, we should know what are sucker fish and why they are important for your tank. Sucker fish fall into a broad category of mostly bottom-dwelling freshwater fish that often use their specialized ventral mouth to feed and attach themselves to the ground or structure around them. Many are specialized algae eaters, while others graze on driftwood or feed on small invertebrates. Sucker fish belong to several groups, including the family Loricariidae, which includes the well-known sucker mouth catfish. Other sucker fish species like the Siamese algae eater are cyprinids from the same family as well-known fish like goldfish and barbs. Suckerfish live in various natural habitats, from lakes and small freshwater streams to slower-moving channels of larger rivers. Many are nocturnal fish, but adapt well to aquarium life and can be active in dim lighting. You should know these things before buying any sucker fish for your tank. Now I think you are well aware of suckerfish and why they are important in your fish tank. So let's cover the top 10 best sucker fish in the aquarium hobby. It's time to learn more about 10 great sucker fish species you can keep. Different types of sucker fish have different needs, so I've included a list of the most important information about each species you need to know. So if you are interested in the aquarium hobby, then make sure to subscribe to our channel where we discuss all the important topics related to the aquarium hobby. In the first position on our list is Otisinclus catfish. The Otisinclus catfish is the best sucker fish for nano aquariums. However, that doesn't mean this smaller species won't enjoy a larger tank. Otos are incredibly peaceful little fish that love to eat algae. You'll usually find these entertaining little fish sucking on the aquarium's glass, ornaments, or plants. They will also swim around in the midwater of the aquarium and will be much happier if kept in groups. Otisinclus catfish are small, peaceful fish that are easy targets for large, predatory fish like oscars and cichlids. Don't house Odo catfish with aggressive fish or fish that have a giant mouth. They will eat these fish if you do so. Now let's learn about the Chinese algae eater, another great fish that also helps in cleaning your aquariums. The Chinese algae eater is an unusual fish you might not expect to be popular among fish keepers. They're not highly colorful, and they like to live alone. Chinese algae eaters are solitary, non-schooling fish with semi-aggressive nature. These fish will fight fish of a similar size, including other Chinese algae eaters if housed together in captivity. The Chinese algae eater is a prevalent sucker fish in the hobby, but one that should not be bought before doing careful research. These sucker fish can be pretty aggressive when they get older and have the scary habit of latching onto other fish and sucking on their slime coating. Now let's learn about bristle nose placos, our next sucker fish on this list. If you're looking for a strange and unique sucker fish for your aquarium, the bristlenose placow could be a perfect choice. These fascinating fish are also known as the bushy nose placows. They are a peaceful breed among tropical fish. To make sure they live happily in your tank, you should buy at least five or six because they are schooling fish. Any number lower than five will make them feel bad and they can even get sick because of this. A small flower pot to hide in and some driftwood to graze on will keep this fish happy in the home aquarium. With a maximum length of only 5 inches, the bristlenose is one of the tiniest placow fish. They are brown, green, or gray, with white or yellow spots on their bodies. Some have uneven coloring, with lighter and darker splotches on different regions of their bodies. The fish in our fourth position is Siamese algae eater. Siamese algae eaters are awesome little sucker fish, famous for their habit of eating black brush algae. This makes them an excellent choice for planted tank enthusiasts who want a little help keeping their tank clean. They eat a wide range of meals and may swiftly clear a tank of green algae. However, these fish requires the most attention from the algae-eating fish mentioned in this video. Siamese algae eaters are commonly seen in groups, although they can sometimes be found alone. 
When two are kept together, they frequently form their own area as they get older. On position fifth, let's learn about zebra play cow. The zebra play cow is among the most visually appealing catfish species with a striking black and white striped pattern. The zebra play cow is one of the best looking sucker fish in the hobby. They stay pretty small, making them a good choice for smaller fish tanks. These eye-catching sucker fish are generally peaceful but can be aggressive towards other bottom-dwelling fish in the tank. Zebra play cows also need hot water conditions to thrive, so keep that in mind before buying them for your tank. After zebra play cow, let's learn about our next fish, which is self and play cow. The self and play cow is an interesting freshwater fish that we recommend quite often to the fish keepers who have larger tanks. They have an interesting look, are relatively peaceful, and don't have complicated care requirements. Due to their size, a lot of fish keepers tend to gravitate to other play cows instead of the sailfin. But if you have larger tank, we think you should give this species a try. The sailfin play cow is a large and beautiful sucker fish from South America. The average sailfin size is between 13 to 19 inches in length when fully grown. These are huge fish. They get their name from their substantial upright dorsal fin. These peaceful fish are easy to keep and do well in community setups. However, they need a large aquarium to thrive at over a foot in length. After self and Placo, now let's learn about Trinidad Plecostomus. The Trinidad Placo is a large species closely related to the common Placo or sucker mouth catfish. It is a large algae eater that requires a large aquarium with plenty of swimming space. They are very gentle and helpful cleaners in large community tanks. The Trinidad Placao is a tropical freshwater fish that may be found in various water types and can adapt to almost any freshwater environment. It has formed colonies in Florida's canals and even brackish water locations along the coast, which makes Trinidad the best sucker fish for your aquarium. On the eighth position on this list is the spotted sailfin Plecostomus, one of the best sucker fish. The spotted sailfin is a large freshwater catfish that is found primarily in the northern area of South America. The spotted sailfin placo is the marbled sailfin or the gold spot placo. These sucker fish are usually very peaceful with the other fish in their tank, but tend to show aggression towards their species and other placos. These peaceful fish are easy to keep and do well in community setups. These sucker mouth catfish get big, so provide them with enough space. In our ninth position, there is Peppermint Plecostomus. The Peppermint Placo is another incredible armored sucker mouth catfish of the Loricariidae family. These sucker fish are covered with whitish spots that create an amazing look, almost like the starry night sky. Peppermint Placos are peaceful fish perfect for community aquariums with some water movement to recreate their natural habitat. The Peppermint Plecostomus has a dark brown to black coloration and is one of the most attractive Placos. Many little dazzling white dots can be found on the body and fins. They're a great complement to any serene, freshwater community aquarium. Now let's move to our final fish on this list, which is Tiger Plecostomus, so let's learn about it. Tiger Placos have beautiful markings, which is why they are named after big striped cats. Tiger Placos are usually black and white, although colorful golden morphs are available in the pet trade. These fish are peaceful in a community setup, but should not be kept with other placos to avoid territorial behavior or possible hybridizing. These are some of the best sucker fish popular in the aquarium hobby. And if you like this video, please let me know with your comments that it will help me get better ideas on what type of content to make videos for you. And if you like this video and want more updates about the aquarium hobby, please subscribe to our channel Aquarium Store Depot for more updates. This will help me create more content and videos on fish and aquarium related queries to help you thrive in the aquarium hobby. Thanks for watching this video. And if you want to add plants to your tank, watch the right video. And if you have a 10 gallon fish tank and want to know what fish are best for a 10 gallon fish tank, then watch the video on the left of your screen.